That's when it's my favorite. It makes your eyes doing good. Does it now? Half price if you buy two. Wow. You again. Is this your store? <laughs> no. My father's. How much? 800 rupees, please. 800 rupees? Okay, okay for you, 550. Incredible. So, does your father usually leave you here alone? No, he's away fighting the devils. Oh. The Indian army called him up, did they? No, he volunteered. Really? Well, if it was my choice, I wouldn't leave you here alone. All right. That's 300. Bet the deal. 400 rupees plus Ganesh. <laughs> you don't want this. It's broken. See? You don't know the story? Ganesh fought Parashuram while standing guard at his father's yes, door. Yes, to defend the honor of his father, Shiva, and got his tusk hacked off for his troubles. Hmm, interesting. Anyway, it's not for sale. <sighs> right on time. Okay, look, 600 rupees. You can keep the change. Hey, wait! You need the guy. Oh? And what'll that cost me? <laughs> My sister needs me. How am I supposed to get it tonight? Need to be on that truck before it goes. Oh. So, you're gonna miss. How much for it? Did? Not for sale. Don't get me wrong, decent technique on the lift, but I'd like my Ganesh back, please. <sighs> Fine. A for effort, kid. People aren't allowed across the bridge. It's too dangerous. Listen, kid, it's been really fun. You need to make yourself scarce. I have a spare bed in the store. 300 rupees. Best deal in all of India. Oh. Okay, no thanks. I need to get on this truck. Bad idea. The rebels, they hurt people. Listen, I need to help my friend, okay? Tell you what, when I get back, pizza's on me. 
Tío. Tío. Shut up! He's lying. No. Get in the truck. Move it! You've got the wrong man! I swear to you! I said get in the truck! Now! Hey, hey, hey! Don't Shh. be stupid, yes, sir. You! Come Go on. home. Damn it. Get out of here! Go on! Pass out. Guess I don't have a choice. Hey, hold on! <laughs> What's your rush? How do I know you're not smuggling something in here? Arms up. Hey. It's dangerous to be out so late. Hey! Where do you live? What are you, deaf? Answer him! I said, where do you live? Arabtazan. I'm in the middle of something. You can wait. Uh, yes, sir. Meet me inside. Understood. You, with me. Man the gun. Sir, what about her? Just let her through. You heard him. Get going. Lucky for them, I've got somewhere to be. door. Check. Not this way.
overload. Don't smoke. You are useless. I can't sell it. I want it. No, thank you. Is that the last of them? Almost. There's a couple more in the alley. <clears throat> You're moving out tonight? I can't wait. I'm tired of these people. <clears throat> no. Asad says one week. Another week in this shit home. Remember the end goal, brother. You still have that bottle of coconut arah? I might. What is it worth to you? My eternal gratitude. Not good enough. Where the hell did you get a bottle of a rock anyway? Down the street from here. This one guy had a large collection. Think there's any left? I only took two bottles. Going over later. Lotus. The hell does that mean? <laughs> Long enough. I've been with Asaf since he was chasing down small trinkets all over India. To join the real fight. This place is a shit hole. that for much longer.
Pink Lotus. Not what I was picturing. There was at least two targets. One was the warehouse, the other... You're in the wrong place, girl. What the hell? I've got you now. You're late, Fraser. I see you too. Holy shit! They took out the first one! Stop them! What the hell was that? I thought you were a professional. Oh, you should relax. You'll live longer. Relax? It took me weeks to track down a soft. The man's as unpredictable as they come. He's just another warmonger with no water fight. No, you don't know him like I do. He changes location and routines by the hour. We'd be foolish to take unnecessary risks. We? Let's get one thing straight. This is my gig. You want your share? We play by my rules. What's it gonna be? He's the one with the beard. That's the spirit. Mm. Handsome. If you're into psychopaths. Nobody's perfect. Where's base camp? Top floor balcony. All right. Let's do this. Had a street route all planned out. But they'll be looking for us now. What do you suggest? I'll think of something. Come on, I'll give you a boost up. <sighs> there you go. Thank you. So bad. Up here. Really? Really. Careful on this one. You sure this is safe? No. Way. You realize we're moving away from a sod's den? Yeah, we're taking the long way. Now I see why you're always late. Copy that Cobra one. Shit. That doesn't work. Well, where to now? Up. Okay.
Just exploring our options. Sit tight. Sorry about that. How about we avoid crates from now on? Okay, good deal. Up ahead. Up one. Shit. There's some cheap office supplies if you want them. You're almost this talkative on the job. Yeah. One less problem. It's just above us. See? It wasn't so bad. It wasn't. So just take a moment. There's one. <coughs> oh, that works. Let's find that disc. Thank you very much. Watch our backs, yeah? Yeah. An antique shop. He's been a busy boy. How much do you think it's all worth? Enough to keep his little insurrection going for quite some time. Hmm. Indian Christian. Is that it? No. Just looking. It doesn't bother you. These are all Indian artifacts. It's not my fight. Hmm. Destroyer and Transformer. Salah and the Tiger. Maybe he's closer than I thought. No one will miss this.
I'll just borrow this. Fraser. Mm hmm. Come here. That looks promising. It's locked. Not for long. What was that map? Western Ghats, Wesala territory. Shit. No, it's all right. Nothing we didn't already know. Uh. Shit. Uh. Oh, missed it. Time to go. Nadine Ross. What a pleasant surprise. Ah, ah, careful, brothers. This tiger's got claws. The soft. Oh, all these years. And you haven't aged a day. You're too kind. <laughs> Are you looking for work? I hear that Shoreline's under new management. Temporary setback. Nothing I can't handle. Of course, of course. Pity though. My men and I could use someone of your caliber. This isn't your area of expertise. It, it is a nice collection, I must say. Chloe Fraser, collector of antiquities. A thief? You're working for a thief. Sir, we have a situation. The disc. Oh, right. About that. At first, I mistook you for just an average rebel. Oh. But you have managed to find the Hoysala Empire. That's not bad. Their greatest treasure. The Tusk of Ganesh. Now that's not an easy find. What are you doing? Three Persian invasions. Three separate wars, and all these years later, no one has found it. We're close. You're lost. And the only chance you have of even narrowing down its location is to find someone who can help you crack this artifact. Someone with an extensive knowledge of Hoysala society. Exactly. Mm. An expert in their culture and history. My rates are reasonable. A parasite who exploits our struggle in order to fatten her pockets. Hmm. So that's a no? Felt like a no. <laughs> You've got balls. I like that. But I don't need any more so-called experts. Shoot them. Throw their bodies in the river. No need. We'll throw ourselves out. After them! Get them! Oh, get them! Come on! We need to get across the river! Messy but effective. You were going to sell me out, weren't you? It's called improvisation. 
God, who's being unprofessional now? What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you let Asav get the jump on us. I'm starting to wonder whether you're worth the 50%. I knew it. You were going to give me up. Guess the leopard can't change her spots. You know nothing about me. Fair warning. Last person who betrayed me wound up dead. There's your river. Yeah? And your guy better be there. Shit! Yeah, well, time to go! Come on! Right behind you! You want to cross us! going out there. On schedule. Should hit land in about an hour. Great. The tusk of Ganesh. No wonder the whole solar capital was ransacked. Look at this thing. Any luck? I don't need luck. I'd say we can use all the luck we can get. Are you still hung up on a serve so-called expert? Don't worry. But if a serve's not in the gets already, he'll be right on our heels. Plus, he's got weapons. Transports hundreds of men. Like I said, don't worry. <gasps> Looks like some kind of key. Maybe. Let's see. Okay. The trident was Ganesh's weapon. The bow and arrow. Parashuramas, and the axe was a gift from Shiva. The great battle. What? The battle in which Ganesh lost his tusk. I bet we find these symbols. We find the tusk. Not bad, Fraser. Yeah, well. You like my dad for that. Hindu myths were his thing. Might have rubbed off. He must be proud. <laughs> Sun's almost up. I'll go get ready. Nice work. Yeah. 
There's a long way to go to settle an argument. Just for my peace of mind, all right? <laughs> well, nice view. And look. How weird. I'm sorry I doubted you, Chloe. Is her Salah? Hoi Salah. It's not a modern structure, so we're definitely on the right track. What? I don't like it. You don't like anything? No. We've gone nearly a hundred kilometers with no sign of a sov. Glass half full, maybe we got the jump on them. Unlikely. I'll find the tusk. A salve's on you. Understood. Meet you back at the car. Yep. Ah, right where I left it. Still here. Great. Just checking. Here, give me your hand. I'm good, actually. Okay. Want me to drive? Nope. I oh, don't mind. I do. It's a control thing. Sure. Let's just enjoy the serenity, shall we? Got a dumb question. So much for that. How do you know the tusk is still there? It would have turned up in a museum or something by now, right? Plus, I haven't seen any Hoysalar exhibitions. I've never even heard of the Hoysalar before this job. Yeah, well, that's the fault of their last king, really. Young, reckless, launched his empire's wealth, built a new capital to house the tusk and then led the Persians right to their doorstep. And now? Hey, look! Flamingo convention! Oh. <laughs> Refreshing. Could have warned me. Oh, where's the fun in that? So, quite nice to be outdoors, isn't it? Away from the city. Quieter. You come back here often? No. Not really. Oil for fix. Go down. Oh, look at this. Poisonal ruins. Can we get through that gate? I'll check it out. <laughs> the old capitals. What have we got? Halabadu and Balur. I thought these were Ganesh and Shiva. Hmm. Someone's been paying attention. Ganesh was the guardian of Halabadu, the newer of the Hoysala capitals. Shiva was the guardian of the former capital, Balur. Well, the stonework is beautiful, but this isn't much of a defensive wall. Mm. Sculptor's quarters, by the look of it. We're still on the outskirts. 
Didn't take you for an archaeologist. That would be my dad, actually. I'm just a thief, remember? Hey, is the rental equipped for the winch? Looks that way. Oh, great. That'll make short work of these gates. What, you're just going to pull them down? That's the plan, unless you bought dynamite. This is your gig. Take that as a no. Where were we? You were about to pull down an ancient gate. Yeah, I was. And there we go. You're awfully quiet. I'm just surprised is all. Figured you'd be more of a leave no trace type when it comes to Indian runes. Sentimentality in this line of work? Get you killed. Whoa, what? They're just large flying rodents. Actually, no, they're not. Yeah, they are. They're closer to primates and lemurs. Okay, well, I'll look it up. Go, 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 go! we go. Made it. Stop. A soft. Well, well spotted. Shit. He's brought a whole battalion with him. Might even be more inside already. Hey, I'm flattered that he's taking us so seriously. We need to get through that gate. All right, we'll slow down. We gotta take care of these jokers first. You have a plan? Yeah. Sure. Here goes nothing. Hang on. Shit. What was that?
Guy down here. Watch yourselves. Search every inch of this place. We're clear. Just like I planned. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Figure the mechanism is above the gate. I'll get the gate open. Bring the car round? Sure. Thank you. This looks to be it. Shotgun. I'm perfectly capable of driving, you know. I'm sure you are, honey. I just prefer to. Oh, it's a lot of ground to cover. True, but unlike your boy Asab, we've got an advantage. The three symbols. Let's have a look at the map. Okay, let's see. We are right about here. I can mark it up as we go. Check out that tower. Bet you could get the lay of the land from up top. Maybe. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for a soft. Perfect. Not that I'm too worried about it, you know. You should be. We won't have the advantage of surprise again. Don't think he was expecting much from you. Wait. Was that a compliment? That that sounded like a compliment. His guys are idiots, but a solve this. We just need to stay the hell away from him. Never understood the appeal of people like Asav. Easy. He finds men who are weak and offers them power. Gives them purpose. Purpose. Sounds more like bullshit to me. How'd you get tangled up with the Sav anyway? Purpose? Rather not go into it. He certainly seemed to have a thing for you. Don't remind me. Proved useful at the time, but... Yeah. Oh, hold up. Careful. More of a Sav's forces. Right. Where were we? You were talking about a Sav. Yeah. So, anyway, uh, do tell. Rather not. Maybe over drinks? Not enough alcohol in the world.
Right, you're the military expert. What's Asav's strategy here? He spread out his men, hoping to stop us in our treks. Not what I would do. So what would you do if you were Asav? Besides lose the beard? Hang back? Let you do the heavy lifting, then swoop in and grab up the task once you've done all the hard work. Devious? Practical. Mitigates a lot of risks. Lucky you're on my team. Yeah, you are. I'm a little surprised Assault's not- Where are you going? Wanna climb it with me? I really want to, but, uh, someone should keep watch for Assault's forces. Good call. I'm amazed this thing is still standing. Don't jinx it, please. All right. And we were talking about... You were talking about Assad. Oh, right. I'm a little surprised Assad's not doing the same thing. Maybe his expert knows more than we think. Right. All the more reason to wrap this up quickly, then. Give me a second. I can wait. <laughs> Been away. Easy does it. All right up there? So far, so good. Here's our three symbols. Well, that took less time than I expected. Shiva's axe. Let's see here. Aimed right at those Hoysala ruins. It's an old fortress, tucked into the mountainside. I'll just mark that on the map with an axe. And behind door number two. Huh. Wonder what that could be. For future reference. Let's see what's behind the trident door. Another old fortress. Just beyond those waterfalls. Trident mark on the map for you. Last but not least, the bow door. And another old fortress. Sitting smack dab in the middle of the lake bed. I'll jot a bow on the map in that spot. Whoa! Guess I should have looked for a call button before climbing up. Was it worth a climb? And then some. Found the three symbols. Really? Yep. Each one was pointing towards a different fortress. Those will be the best places to look. Perfect.
rebels haven't left this spot. Yeah. Mm. Well, here goes nothing. Sav's expert demanded that the sites be unspoiled. Always telling us what we should and shouldn't do. I am tired of picking through this crap. Justice requires patience, brother. Has the boss checked in yet? He will get here. <laughs> Okay? Something is off. In the clear. Let's have a look around. Fragile. <laughs> Don't recognize this. It's not one of the three symbols. We should stay focused. Never say no to a chance to make some extra cash. Interesting. Some kind of Hoysala token. It's not one of our three symbols. Might be worth trading once we get back home. I hope that was productive. Just a token of some kind. Old Hoysala thingy. Think we need it? Need? Probably not. Want? Definitely. One of Asov's trucks. Looks clear out here. Interesting circular motif. Like the disc. We're definitely in the right place.
Look up there. Parashurama's bow. Matches the symbol in the tower. So, Parashurama. 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 Right. Who was he again? Hey. Okay. Sixth avatar of the god Vishnu. A fearsome warrior. Trained in the martial arts by Shiva himself, but only after conquering the whole world to convince him of his worthiness. <laughs> and I thought I had it bad. This should do the trick. was hard to say a fortress not the right layout for a temple nice to be out of that shithole finally I was starting to think the boss was all talk. I'd watch your mouth. Sorry. Soon it won't matter. Once we have the task, the people will follow like sheep. Yeah, even the mighty Indian army will tremble. I can't wait. Hey, who's there? It's Fraser! That's it. We're clear. Probably allured to the others. Can't be helped. Come on. There, on the mountain! Here come the others! You boys really don't want me shooting from down here. Be the last of them. There was a big truck parked out front. We'll keep our eyes open. <sighs> Would have preferred a head start over a solve. Not much we can do. Besides, doesn't matter who starts, only who finishes. Fair point. What is it? A shrine? Don't think so. Don't see any deities hanging about. Let's find a way up.
on. I see them, but they don't see us. Watch your rod. How are you so relaxed? Didn't you hear those gunshots? I did. You worry too much. Our brothers are trained by Asab himself. Uh, I'm keeping my safety off, just in case. Mine was never on. Was it? Look, on your right. What did you find? I think we are good here. They've made us. Now. Oh shit, guess this can wait. Yes, it is. Let's press on. Just what I was gonna say. Look, he's opening that gate. Perfect. That should do it. at least. Damn it. See another way over here? Sit tight. Or stand. Stand tight. Copy that. Fine. Okay, guess this isn't the way in. Oh, there you are, having fun. Uh, 
Somebody there? Made it. Impressive. Thanks. Come on. Well, looky here. What are you willing to bet? Told you it's some kind of key. Gold star for you. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient Hoysala jigsaw puzzle? Ah, of course. I'm making a bow. Sharama. Now what? Now I guess we turn this crank and see what happens next. You think it's safe? You know that treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Neither is being a mercenary. The difference is when I pull the pin on a night, I know what's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. <laughs> Did you hear that? You feel that? Teresa, mm -hmm. mm. mm. look at that. Holy hell. There's a massive relief carved into the side of that mountain. And you were worried that we were going to turn that crank and die. Guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learned a lot. Oisalar Empire was kind of his thing. <sighs> Took up a lot of his time, though. Me, if I go. Digging for treasure, I better make a buck or two. Oh, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business? Hmm. Made a real mess of it. Well, you should know. Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well, it's a conversation for another time. So, where to next? There's the fort above the waterfalls with the trident. And there's the fort in the mountain sporting the axe. I suppose I should have asked about the Drakes before I took the job. Not much to tell. I know Nate pretty well, Sam less so. He seemed to just appear out of thin air. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. This is open now. So, waterfalls and mud. Check.
Hey, just so you know, Nathan Drake is no longer in the picture. You don't have to worry about him. I had my concerns. Why do you accept my offer? I'm not one to look a gift horse in the mouth, especially with everyone wanting to see me fall. I hear that. But on the plus side... Oh, there's a plus side? Oh, when people have low expectations, it's much easier to take them by surprise. As far as I'm concerned, this business is tough enough on your own. You have to take any advantage you can. You always worked alone? Mostly. How old were you when you started? Young. Learned quickly enough I needed to let people think they were getting their way, and then I could get the upper hand. Too subtle for me. I always prefer the direct approach. Yeah, whatever works, I say. Incredible. You got that right. Want a closer look? Sure. Magnificent. How long do you suppose it takes to carve something like this? Years. Decades, even. The Hoi Sala certainly did have a knack for stonework. And the war, it seems. That too. They must have made these to commemorate their victories against the Persians. Looks like they put up a good fight. They did. Pity it didn't last. But their loss is our gain, right? That carving looks familiar. That carving is an exact match for the disc. So what does that mean? I don't know, but it looks as though we have two more symbols to find. Copy that.
Hey, steady. Looks like we've got rebels ahead. Hey, look. Shiva's axe. Spotted this on the tower, too. Shiva. Who's the god of destruction, right? Yes. But maybe not in the way you're thinking. Not literal destruction, then? That, but also in a more positive sense, like losing the ego, ditching bad habits. Shedding old attachments. Exactly. Once more, with gusto. Here we go. Hey, I'll take care of this one. Okay. Salah versus the tiger. Doesn't seem like a fair fight. Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. I'll learn something new today. There'll be a quiz later. I mean, don't drink it or anything. <coughs> Rog! <sighs> now what? Uh, the whole complex is flooded. Let's find a way out. They've left their climbing gear. They should come in handy. <clears throat> Correction. Our climbing gear. Oh. Oh. God. 
Bit hard on the wrists. Damn. We made it. Oh my. We'll find out soon enough. Okay, let's see what this does. Go to hell. That's elaborate. Oh shit. That you moved again. Oh. Turns out getting walloped by an axe. That's a little. Hey you. Wanna give it a shot? <laughs> Not paying me nearly enough. get you? No. Oh, for goodness sake. Three statues, with two different symbols now. A star, and rings. They're all Hoysala sun symbols, but I like your descriptions better.
Ah, uh, figured we had one more to go. Everything always comes in three. Feels good to be outside. Death. Smelt like death. Yeah. I was thinking mildew was on the way. Definitely death. Here we go. Guess this will be a picture of an ex. Good guess. Right. Let's turn the water on. Well, well. What's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. <laughs> Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh. Oh. I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. Two out of three now. Moss and I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand, on the outskirts of Halibadoo. That's... pretty funny. 
And the last fort's nestled above the falls, the one with the trident. Australia. Your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. Let's head back to the car. Gotta love a shortcut. Well, if we don't have to go back the way we came. I would have made you dodge the axes. Oh, Christ! Fraser! by the falls left. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Makes more sense why it solves after the tusk now. Figured he just wanted the money, like us. He'll use it to rally people to his cause wavered in the government's face. Just like all the other times. This has happened before? Oh yeah. Ever since the young king lost to the Persians, everyone's wanted to lay claim to it, to this land. And here I thought we were just going on a treasure hunt. We are. Let men like Asar fight over it. It's none of our concern. Fighting wars was my concern for a time. Good point. But you did it for the cash. Usually. What about when you worked for Asar? <laughs> Definitely a cash grab. Hardly worth the trouble. Ouch. Why do it then? Needed to establish my rep, eh? Figured I'd start with the worst of the bunch. Nowhere to go but up after that. Beautiful. Wait a sec. Over there, in that cliff wall. See that archway? Looks intact. You coming with? Feel like stretching my legs. Right, Eo. What is this place? You got me. <laughs> well, will you look at that? Monkeys. You seem excited. I like monkeys. Looks like there's something in the structure there. Yeah, monkeys. Besides monkeys. I don't see a way across. Neither do I. <laughs> what have we here? See. Is it just me, or does that look like a map? Looks like our map. Huh. I'll just jot that down. Another crest of a Hoysala king. Someone went to a lot of trouble to hide this. Symbols up there. Symbols? There's a slot. Just the right size for a token. Let's give it a whirl. They filled up the spots on the map. Yeah. Wonder what happens if we find them all. Those figures must be the old Hoysala kings. Eleven, all in all. Look at that bracelet. 
It must have belonged to one of their queens. This going to help us get the tusk? I don't think so, but... Extra cash. <laughs> right. Right. Come on, let's get back to it. Okay, so we were talking about... Anyway, like I was saying, beautiful out here. Is this your first visit to India? Yeah. Not a lot of perks in this line of work, but travel is definitely one of them. Where have you been? Ah, uh, where haven't I been? Whichever question works for you. Well, I haven't been to the States. Really? Yeah, well, the stuff I'm looking for is usually old, right? The US was only founded a couple of hundred years ago. True. What about you? Where do you want to go? Iceland. Nice choice. Beautiful there. Well, it's quiet. Unspoiled. And I want to see those northern lights. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, that's on the bucket list too. You should go when we're done here. Someday. Have other things to attend to first. Coming? Right behind you. Let's get out of here. I'm just going to take a look around. Yeah, I'll keep an eye out. <laughs> Trying to give away our position? Yes. Another one. I'm just going to take a look around. Do what you have to do.
were losing shape. I am certain your comfort is his highest priority. <laughs> Not hide. I see that four by four. Come out. We are not alone. Where are you, asshole? Okay, all clear. So, find anything down there? Found another token. I'm just going to take a look around. Happy hunting. I'm just going to take a look around. I'll wait here. Ringing the bell removed one of the bars. Another token for my collection.
I'm just going to take a look around. I'll keep myself busy. <laughs> Hello again. from me. I've got your brothers and sisters waiting for you. anything? Got another token for our collection. Shit, the site's compromised. Love a second set of eyes. Oh, I'm in. <laughs> Check it out. It's Ganesh's trident. Man. Glad I climbed that tower, eh? Ganesh. Remover of obstacles. He's a good one to know. You pray to him when you start something new or need to clear your mind of doubts and worry. Oh. Oh, remover of obstacles. Exactly. But why the elephant said? Ah, well, his father Shiva gave it to him. How thoughtful. After Shiva chopped off his human head. Oh. Yeah, we've been there, all of us, am I right? Is the gate secure? Not I've yet. Got back. Waiting on Cobra Just keep 8. Just quiet as long as we can.
Saw something. Down here, we have company. <laughs> Hang on, watch it. Another one down. Keep looking, they are here somewhere. Hey. I think that's a lot of them. You all right? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more positive outlook, sort of. Okay. Let's go find our giant water faucet. Hmm. Okay, that's not it. Know this? What's the trick here? What? Look like a button. Yeah, I just wanted you to have a go at something. What's this? That's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. Two. Hey, here's another. I'll get it. Here's another one. Three down. Last but not least. That should do it. Okay. Back to the big wheel thing. Big wheel thing? Whatever the archaeological term for it is. Mm, big wheel thing works. Come on. 
Looks like we're going under. Radio. There's our faucet. One trident coming up. Oh, what the hell? That's not fair. Hello, sir. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. Whoa! Shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. Here we go. There'd be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? Mm. My partner tends my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with the bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. It was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. All right, what the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want a to get ahead of us. <laughs> 